There have been some changes in GDevelop with how subscriptions work, as well as free accounts. So these changes are basically going to affect everybody. There are more changes to come, and most of them have to do with a new feature that was recently added to the engine, and that's credits. Let's start with the subscriptions. So now if you go to the updated pricing page on GDevelop's website, you'll see the four different kinds of plans. But what we're going to talk about is in the chart. If you scroll down a bit, you'll see claim a premium asset pack or template as one of the things that you get for a gold or pro subscription. Every month, anybody with a gold or pro subscription will be notified of which pack or template is there for them to claim. The asset pack or template will be from those made by GDevelop. And depending on what kind of subscription you have, you'll get some amount of credits added to your account every month. But now let's talk about credits. Currently they have two uses in engine. You can use them for marketing your game or to buy things. Let's start with marketing. In the engine, if you go to your home page and go to manage and then open up your game, you can go to marketing and ads to see the different kinds of plans available. There's the basic plan that will get your game promoted on GD.Games, which is great for getting more player feedback on your game. The pro plan, which will get you featured on the newsletter and social media. And then my personal favorite is the premium plan that will get your game advertised on the banner in engine, just like these games up here. Your game will be added to the carousel in engine. To get credits, you can click on this button here and you'll see the different options where the more you buy, the better the value. And then along with these plans, you can also use credits to buy things in engine. So if you go to the asset store and pick one of the bundles, you can see down in the bottom, there's an option to pay with credits instead of paying with money. Along with the asset packs, you can also buy the templates with credits. Along with buying credits, you'll also be able to earn them by taking part in things like GDevelop game jams, for example. In the near future, you'll be able to use credits to get extra exports for your game and some other online features that would normally require a subscription. We're hoping that this credit system will allow people to get more out of the engine even if they don't get a subscription. And for those who do have a subscription, getting free GDevelop credits means that they're going to get even more out of that subscription. For now though, if you haven't seen the latest big update video, check it out here.